The majority of people, approximately 99%, are not willing to undertake the necessary steps to turn their dreams into reality. This truth is encapsulated in a saying from the Marines, everyone yearns to reach paradise, yet few are prepared to endure the hardships. The fundamental essence of manifesting any dream resides in self-discipline. Consider something as basic as food and eating. It extends beyond nourishing the body. It primarily involves training the mind. It entails gaining control control over your thoughts and making choices that serve your best interests. Each day, we make decisions that do not align with our well-being. When it seems like the world is attacking you, attempting to keep you down, it is crucial to resist becoming your own worst enemy. Avoid self-sabotage that hinders your pursuit of dreams. I understand that the term discipline carries negative connotations, often associated with punishment. However, when I speak of discipline, I refer to the ability to forego immediate gratification in exchange for long-term self-respect. In my perspective, self-discipline embodies self-love. When you profess love for yourself, it signifies that your behavior towards yourself is rooted in compassion. Self-discipline stands as the cornerstone of achieving material success. If you cannot conquer your own mind, you will be unable to overcome the challenges that the world presents. Self-love involves making choices that honor your true potential. Allow me to provide an example. Suppose you feel a deep connection with someone, but they happen to be your partner's cousin. Out of self-love, you would resist pursuing that connection, recognizing that it would disrupt the harmony of your relationship. Similarly, imagine having a craving for pizza, but realizing that indulging in it would leave you feeling unwell. Out of love for yourself, you would choose to abstain. Self-discipline serves as an expression of self-love. If you seek happiness, you must prioritize self-care and guide your actions accordingly. Sustained happiness comes from disciplining your behavior. It is vital to understand that our self-esteem should not rely on the opinions of others. True self-esteem should be based on how we genuinely feel about ourselves. Allowing external validation to determine your worth is akin to gazing into a shattered mirror and attempting to reshape yourself to fit its distorted reflection. Depending on others' opinions to define your value is a detrimental approach. When something goes wrong, it may not be your fault, but it becomes your responsibility to overcome challenges and create a fulfilling life. For instance, growing up with an abusive alcoholic father is not someone's fault. However, it is their responsibility to confront and heal from those traumas, forging a meaningful life despite the pain endured. Fault and responsibility are not intertwined. Though it may seem unfair, when it comes to matters of the heart, your happiness becomes your sole responsibility. By pointing fingers and fixating on assigning blame, we trap ourselves in victim mode, perpetuating suffering. Empowerment lies in taking full responsibility for your heart, life, and happiness. Remember, while you can bring joy to others, make them smile, or even laugh, their happiness ultimately lies beyond your control. The prerequisite for spending time with someone should be that they nourish and inspire you, igniting the passion within. Take a moment to reflect on your recent text messages. Do the people in your life fuel your inner fire or extinguish it? I yearn for my life, my work, and my family to hold meaning. If I am not positively impacted someone else's life, then I am wasting my time. It is crucial to understand the distinction between talent and skill a concept often misconstrued by those striving for excellence and pursuing their dreams. Talent is an innate gift, while skill is developed through countless hours of unwavering practice. Rather than aspiring to construct the most extraordinary wall from the outset, focus on laying each brick with unwavering precision. Dedicate yourself to perfecting each brick in the present moment. Repeat this process diligently, day after day, and in due time, you will have erected an impressive wall. Psychologically, this approach grants me an advantage over many competitors. Taking the first step can be daunting when faced with a colossal task. The definition of who I am is crystal clear, reshaping my aspirations. I am acutely aware that I possess more strength than I initially believed. Fear drives me. I detest the feeling of being scared to undertake something. Early on, I adopted an attitude of confronting challenges head on. Even in moments of fear, I question myself. Why am I scared? There is no reason to fear until I am scared standing at the precipice. All the fear leading up to that moment is unnecessary. It only taints the day. Once you take the leap, the moment that should instill terror becomes the most blissful experience of your life. The greatest treasures lie beyond moments of terror, where courage is demanded. 
Success is the ultimate goal you strive for, and there's a single path to achieve it. You must become completely devoted to the process. There's no space for fear, doubt, failure, negative thoughts, or giving up. Your potential knows no bounds, so as you awaken each morning, focus your mind on triumph. Embrace the mindset of a winner, conquering the challenges of each day as you enter your classroom. Whether the person to your left is pessimistic, or the one to your right has surrendered, their disposition is irrelevant. Your sole concern should be staying locked in, shielding yourself from the influences of your classmates and the classroom. Success in this race belongs to those who distance themselves from the rest of the pack. Understand that there will be different difficult days, moments when you feel adrift, unsure of your teacher's words or the professor's concepts. However, you must never succumb to self-pity, surrender, or accept defeat. Instead, knock on their door and express, listen, my only option is success in your class. But currently, I'm confused about today's lesson and I need immediate clarity. I assure you, if you possess a genuine passion for success in that class, they will go above and beyond to assist you. However, settling for mediocrity and remaining silent sets you up for failure, and failure is not your destiny. You're not the first to question your ability to achieve greatness. You're not the first to feel inadequate or overwhelmed. Those who persevere through every storm that arises are the ones who ultimately shatter barriers and transform dreams into reality. Here's the undeniable truth. You were born with everything necessary to excel in every class, to overcome the anxiety that threatens to derail your lifelong aspirations. The principle that truly captures our mindset and embodies our beliefs is the idea that dedicated effort yields rewarding results. We, as winners, refuse to lose focus. We recoil at the notion of an easy route because we understand it doesn't exist. If success came effortlessly, everyone would achieve it. Thus, we reject such ignorance and return to our grind, studying with greater intensity than ever before. We comprehend that the effort we invest directly correlates to the outcome we receive. We pour our hearts and souls into our assignments, into preparing for exams, ensuring that we can sleep soundly, knowing we've given our all. And with such unwavering dedication, success becomes an inevitable outcome. Amidst all the toil, the studying, the sweat, and the tears, there may still be instances of failure. But never forget this truth. You never truly fail, nor do you lose. Instead, you learn. Life won't strike you down when you least expect it. It's an integral part of the process. It's during these moments that you must remind yourself that setbacks forge strength, wisdom, intellect, and an insatiable hunger for success. So, consider this a friendly reminder. You possess the power to triumph. You were born to achieve greatness, leap over obstacles, navigate around pitfalls, and persist through adversity. Within you lies a dormant volcano of success, eagerly awaiting your permission to erupt.